I see enormous potential here. Why? Because great couples always have a great story about how they met. First meeting Alicia um, had to be about four years ago. At the Jersey Shore. And he said he just always knew her, you know, and they were, they would meet passing by. My friend had left me and uh, I needed a ride home. And I get a random text message from my friend Ivan that some girl needs a ride home. He's like, I can't drive you home, but my friend can. So I was like, I don't know your friend. He's like, don't worry, he's cool. And right from the start, she was difficult. Couldn't figure out where to meet me, couldn't tell me where to meet her. I thought he was. Apparently a nice guy since he was willing to give a strange girl a ride home. So she gets in the car and now me and my friend Anthony for one weekend we're tired. The volume immediately went up to like 25. A couple years later, I run into the same good Samaritan who drove me home. Went out for my birthday that night with a few friends. I saw her at Fushimi. I was like, hey, remember me? We really became friends, like we would just text, how, how you doing? You know, but then it grew into, you know, something more serious. Anthony was over the top. Anthony was the happiest person. She was excited. She was dating a new guy. She's like, he's a really good guy. I mean, the kid was just glowing. She met this, uh, this guy who she thought was, um, was a real nice guy for her. You gotta meet Flip. When are you gonna meet Flip? Flip this, flip that. Is he an acrobat? Two months in, I realized this was it. I think Anthony wanted to marry the day he met her. <laughs> she was like, I think he's the one. I'm like, are you serious after six months? When they say you just know, um, I think I had finally reached that point. I loved being with her. I, I was so happy. So the story leading up to my engagement. Oh, it was so great how they did that. I knew she said from the start that she wanted her family to ask. Well, Anthony contacted me. He's like, I think I want to propose to your sister. His idea was to propose to her in the morning when she woke up. You can't do that. I said, not with my sister. I said, you'll never hear the end of it. Plan was we were going after Lizette's birthday. Basically, we all go out to this Mexican restaurant that we always go to in, in Queens. We plan everything. So it looks like a birthday party. So in the middle of singing happy birthday is when we would flip the script and he would surprise her with the ring. Anthony was a nervous wreck. <laughs> if we were to be on time, if we were going to be dressed right. They were still on the Staten Island Expressway in traffic and we were already on the BQA. And my sister was in a rush to get there because she didn't want to miss the reservation. And meanwhile, I'm trying to text Anthony and say, you better stall her. That's when the nerves and the sweating really started to kick in because I was like, we're going to be there before them. And then the sis her sister's going to walk in with all the balloons and the whole thing's going to be ruined. Traffic was terrible. I drove like a maniac. Luckily, um, her sister got there before we did. We had to go in and give the waiter the flowers and hide the balloons, so he had to put them all the way in the back. And anyway, she came in the restaurant, had no idea. The plan worked perfectly. Um, the ring got put on the dessert, the mariachi band came out singing happy birthday, but instead of putting the dessert in front of Lizette, they put it in front of her. I'm like, it's not my birthday, it's my sister's, and I'm trying to move it on over. Lizette moved it back in front of her, and then she moved it back to Lizette. And the ring was sitting there, and she's looking at her sister, I was like, come blow out the candles, blow out the candles. I started nudging her to look down, look down. And so then there was, you know, there was my ring. Alicia was just in total shock and awe. It was a beautiful evening. Yeah, Anthony was the right choice for her. I think they're gonna have a great life together. Because they're gonna love each other and they're gonna kiss and hug. And we died. I just want to wish Alicia and Anthony all the best in their marriage. All the best from the bottom of my heart. I want to wish Anthony and Alicia a wonderful, happy, long life together. Congratulations. I wish you a lot of love, health, and happiness. Congratulations, guys. Wish you nothing but the best. Mi deseo para mis hijos de todo corazón que sean muy felices, que Dios les bendiga y siempre tengan salud, vida y mucho amor. Congratulations. To Rara and Anthony, I love you so, so, so much. Alicia, you are the love of my life. I can't wait to have this special day together and a lifelong of happiness together. You are my everything.
aunt. My best friends, my other half, my soulmate. I love you so much and I can't wait to see what our future holds.